And you know this good looking man here with this great camera in his hand. Today the stakes are especially high because I'm shooting an actual ad today for CoverGirl Exact <laughs> Eye Lights. You guys have to make every single frame count because I have to walk out of here with an actual ad for CoverGirl. Nice. Hello. Right, give me that in your eye there. Yes, 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 yes. Give it to me. Ooh, yes. that's it. Yeah, we I got think we it. got it now. We got it. We got it. Thank you. Yeah. Ooh, yes, yeah. She nailed it on every single frame. I couldn't be happier or more surprised for her. Rock on, superstar. Yes! Megan is a total natural. She's a total cover girl. This should be a walk in the park for her. It's looking a little too nightclub-y. We thought Megan was the full package, and so like my perception of hers changed. Can she really pull it off? Megan stepped onto the set, and she just didn't seem present. She seemed a little awkward. You know, the fact that we had to struggle to get one or two good shots was, you know, kind of a disappointment to us. Woo! It wasn't easy. We got it. First up, highly sought after celebrity and fashion photographer, and now someone who has shot the four of you, Mr. Mike Ruiz. Hey, cover girls. Hey. Let's see your best shot. As soon as you stepped on set, your confidence kind of transcended everything, and I think you did a, a really amazing job. Okay, Miriam. My jaw dropped when you stepped on set because you were just giving it to me, and you were giving me tons of variety. Wow. Everything wow. was beautiful. And you were restrained and subtle and sweet. It just, like, rocked my world. Thanks, Miriam. All right, Megan. I know that, you know, the hair and makeup thing kind of threw you, and I was just hoping that you were gonna give me, like, more variety and, and be more present. Like, you know, you were so overwrought. All right, Nikita, let's take a look. Oh, now, okay, now what's the look? Honestly, came here thinking I'm being eliminated because this photo is gonna be horrible because I don't look like a cover girl. Megan is blonde, blue-eyed in the back there, and she didn't have such a great shoot. Sure. I kind of don't even buy the self-deprecating thing. I think it's kind of your defense mechanism. Drop it. It's not. It's, 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 it's boring <laughs> and it's old. Like, ooh, I don't know. I don't like my hair. So that we'll have a preconception that you're working to see an ugly picture and then it's fabulous because you're you're way too confident for all this self-deprecating stuff. Let's finally take a look at your best shot. I mean, you totally nailed it. Could be better. Could be worse. No, no, not at all. It couldn't be better. It's. I think it's freaking great. Well, we are a little tortured right now. Miriam gave me that subtlety, that smile, the head back. She was overloaded with confidence and understanding what she needed to deliver, and she totally delivered it. Oh, I buy this shot the most as a cover girl shot. Megan. Any of the girls should have been able to nail this girl next door thing. It should have been Megan, and she was the one who failed the most. We made our decision. Helping me make the difficult decision of who goes home tonight are our panel of experts. First up, highly sought after celebrity and fashion photographer, Mr. Mike Ruiz. All right, Lindsay. Wow. Your body language is so empowered in the shot. It's just so confident. It's a really beautiful thing to see. All right, Nikita. Fabulous. What? Slick and edgy. Granted, your hand is a little awkward. We're talking about this was a cover try week. That's a big deal for a model. Huge deal. So who technically would get the cover here? To me, of the three photos, this is the most believable one. You know what? The reality is, is she's delivered. How many pictures of the week? At she's this a wreck. Stage, she's at this an emotional stage. wreck. That whole facade that she puts on of, of being self-deprecating is not real. It's all this reverse psychology crap that she's yes. trying to play on us. What do you think of Megan? Megan's body looks stunning and amazing in this shot. Well, it looks like we found our two girls to stomp it out. All right, so Megan, let's take a look at your walk on the runway. Can we say legs for days, first wow. of all? <laughs> yeah. I thought when you first came out, you were a little stiff. There were moments where you're just very restricted, but also your head was a little too high. With your chin too far up, it looks like you're above yeah. the audience. It's important to engage the audience. All right, well, Lindsay, let's take a look at your performance on the runway. 
the energy is great, and it's kind of a glimpse of like you know your true essence, and you know that's what we we're trying to that's what showed, beat out yeah. of you. So the next week, you guys were in New York City. This shoot, you had the opportunity to kind of do two photos that mm -hmm. week because you were styling the diva or your alter ego. We all love your commitment in this, Lindsay. And I remember you explaining what your thought process was going into this photo shoot. Mm -hmm. And that's an indication of somebody who's passionate about what they do is to give it as much thought and is willing to put as much on the line as the rest of the creative team. And that was one of my favorite pictures. And I think all of us can agree it is a great mm -hmm. picture. And you finally were photo of the week. Well, let's take a look at the next week. It was a big oh, week because you guys is... shot CoverGirl ad with Mr. Mike Ruiz. The great thing about both of your shots were you both have impeccable, beautiful skin. Everything about these photos impressed me. You know what, guys? We got two portfolios here that have knocked my socks off. Lindsay came into this competition way under the radar. And the fact that she rose to the occasion so expediently kind of makes me really optimistic. She's stunning. She takes great photos. And she could actually work in this industry. Megan, for me, has the most immediate physical impact as a model. This book is remarkable. I mean, like, she looks like a professional model. When she walked out on that runway last night, her presence, her... Presence? You her, felt presence her? Her physical yeah, presence. I did. I you did. Know, her, yeah. Yes, she I was totally awesome. did. Not, so not interesting enough. Canada's Next Top Model has to be a standout. Well, then what? We got to choose one. What are we going to do? Well, we want Canada's Next Top Model to well, have an astronomical well, career. Yes, well, and that that's... Okay. Then yes. I think she should be Canada's Next Top Model. Let's bring the girls back in. Let's announce the winner. Megan. You're the model. I'm the model. <laughs>